Well, today also people all over the Philadelphia region celebrated African traditions at the 42nd annual Adun Day Festival, a gathering of cultures celebrated with music, traditional dance, and lots of unbelievable food. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Nieves was there. Live music, traditional African dance, and an array of African, Caribbean, even soul food. All the sights and sounds signature to South Philly's Odunde Festival. Ice cold waters. Since 1975, this festival has drawn upwards of 500,000 people to South Street. The one day event now spans over 15 blocks with vendors lined along the streets, many of whom come from all over the world to be here, selling authentic African art and clothing. This is from Congo, it's a shield. Odunde has become one of the largest African-American street festivals in the country, and it all started as a vision of Bumi Fernandez's mother. I was a year old strapped to my mother's back at the first Odunde, and now I carry Odunde on my back with a lot of honor. I like to say for those who love the beautiful, beautiful continent of Africa, we bring it to you on the second Sunday in June. Annually, this festival not only celebrates African culture, but brings quite a benefit to the city. And Odunde has a $28 million economic impact on the city of Philadelphia and a $30 million economic impact on the state. And I think that's very key to know because people say, oh, that's just a festival. No, we are more than a festival. We are an economic driver here in the city of Philadelphia. At the 42nd Annual Odunde Festival in South Philadelphia, Alicia Nieves, CBS3 Eyewitness News.